Man, we rolling. That's funny. Episode 54. Hey, Drew, check it out. Oh, wait. Sorry. Before I get into this, uh, Go Go Riot in uh, Reseda on the 22nd uh, at Last Call and in uh, and July 29th at uh, Alex's Bar with Necromantics. All right, cool. So check it out, man. Uh, uh, read, this, read this sign, okay? I'm, I'm obsessing about people's signs that they're putting on their house. And that they're put, putting in their front yard. Here, read that sign. Read that sign. Read it aloud, please, for the class. <laughs> is that is that cornball central? Is that corny? Is is this what we're doing now? <laughs> read it. Read it all to right, me, right, please. Says, yeah. Read it. Well, to- first of all, the picture's great. It's got a dude fucking following a dog. Yeah. Pick it like sweeping up shit. Yeah. Oh, sweeping? I yeah, didn't see that. It's it, like crosswalk style. Well, it, well, that's silly. It's like a dustpan. Yeah, like I said, sweeping. Oh my god. Okay, so. <laughs> yes. So read it. Read out. Read, uh, read out. Corny. That is. I'm trying. I know it's hard for you to say this, isn't it? <laughs> this is a nudge to pick up the fudge. <laughs> <laughs> what (laughs) so that that's at the park so they put that at the park all right but he's got a broom in lakewood yeah hey jenna he's got a broom yeah why who who sweeps up shit you dummies are they fucking dumb oh it's got the the little scooper the the rake oh well either way all right okay here's my point for one, there's a sign of picking. There's a sign that showing someone picking up dog shit. It's a figure of picking up dog shit. Yeah, that's eternal in a griddle, dude. He's cooking behind. The dog. Like it's it, 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 whether whatever the fucking sign is, it says. I'm, and I'm gonna repeat this. Is, I don't. I don't want to repeat it. It's so corny. It's dumb. This makes me angry. This makes me mad to no end. And there's so many fucking houses around here that are putting out these signs. Does it make you want to nudge something? No, what it makes me... Here's what it does. My dog takes a shit right on that sign. I bring my dog over to that sign to take a shit, and I leave it. Right in front of it. Right in front of it. I I don't pick it up. Now, I always pick up my dog's shit. Always. But if there's a sign, I'm leaving the shit right there. So that sign's doing the opposite of what they want. Is it the sign, or is it the writing? It's what, all, if it, what if it's a, just a regular pick up after your dog sign? Still. Don't. No, not. no, don't do it. Because we all know that. Pick up your, after your fucking dog. If, just because there's a sign Does doesn't it, mean I'm going to do it. The dude that's leaving the dog shit is still leaving the dog He's shit. He's going to leave it anyways. He, does, he didn't go, he didn't go, oh shit, the, there's a sign. I better pick up this dog shit because there's a sign. So what you're saying is don't take away guns. Yeah. <laughs> it, it, I'm saying these people got to take it easy with the signs. No, I hear you. The, the crazy political signs, no matter what your side is, take it easy, guys. Relax. What that shows me is you got no family and you got no friends. Because, because if I saw that. No hobby. Yeah. If, no, no, no. Like if I go over to your house and you got a giant uh, Biden sign in your window. I'm going to go, hey, Drew, I, I don't mind how you feel, buddy. Like, Let's what, get rid of the sign. Why is it the whole front of your house? Yeah, what are you doing? So this house right here has a, um, uh, it says, uh, no abortion is wrong. Now, okay, okay, that's how you feel. Cool, cool, okay, it's okay. The word abortion is just on the street. You know what I'm do you get what I'm trying to say? It's weird to drive by and just see abortion right on the street. I don't care how you feel. even if I agree. I don't it's weird to see abortion now and then right next to it has the don't tread on me uh, sign. But hold on. Hold on. It's not the real sign. It's made into a vagina. It says don't it says don't tread on me, but the snake is made into a vagina. Now I got a little problem with that. I got a little problem. The don't tread on my sign, the, or flag, let's respect that a little. So does that mean no condoms? 
<laughs> well, now hold on. That's that's the first thing. So I burn in I go to text her when that when when Ro, Roe v. Wade got 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 hit. Right. Hey, I when text you, when you go raw, you're gonna go. Hey, yeah. I trade off. I text. I texted her. Hey, I, I go. I go. I go. Well, we're gonna have to pull out way early now. <laughs> and I almost did like a online post that goes that goes. Well, look, guys, you got to start pulling out way early. Yep. That, that's how you fix it. <laughs> but people take that too seriously, and they. You know they'd lose their shit. So I, my other conscience said, "Don't, don't post it." He said, "I'm serious, but I'm not." Yeah, but it's weird. The the you got a big giant vagina sign. It's right on the. It's right on this. Per- it's a nice house. No, I, and then you I got an abortion sign. I don't care how you feel. It's weird that it's just out there for everyone to read. It says uh, abortion. Oh Jesus Christ! Right? Like they're walking their kids, and you just it's like, what the fuck? Yeah. So you're saying whether you agree with the message or not. We don't need the fucking sign. We don't need it. It's, it's get rid of it. Right. It's silly. It's very silly. You feel the same way about flags? Uh, not necessarily, but how about hmm. flags with a message? Yeah. Well, here I did this. I did a little solo podcast where I was going. I, I called it. I just have questions, guys. I just have questions. So the question is the. I think I I probably already brought this up, but you know it was it was Pride Month, right? And you got the rainbow flags. Hey, hey, hey! All good. I ain't, I ain't mad at you. Okay, get it. But it's weird to fly a flag to tell me who you're fucking. <laughs> that is weird, right? If you really think about it, like I said, like I'm gonna put out a flag with Jenna's face on it. <laughs> you know what I mean? That would that would be a little. Now Jenna's like, fuck yeah, I think that's awesome, but. It's kind of odd if you think about it, right? It, w- it like, would even have to be more than that, right? Because well, if I put out a straight flag, like I'm, I, I like girls, you know what I mean? Because that—that's what that—that's what, that, yeah, no, that's what that's it. showing me. I get it. You like the same sex. It's cool. I, I'm with you. It's I weird. Watch. It's weird to fly it, it no, everywhere, it. and it's on your clothes. You're wearing the flag on your thing. You're like, okay, cool. I get it. You like you're you like you're a lesbian. Like we know you're a lesbian, by the way. We, we know you don't need to put a flag on it. The wallet chain showed me that. <laughs> okay, nobody the, confused your high and tight. <laughs> <laughs> Look, hey, hey, my lesbian sisters out there, why do you all have the same asses? How did that happen? Where did that go? That went left. <laughs> okay, sorry. Quick. Let's bring it back. My bad. Let's bring it back. But I'm just. It's just a question. I'm all I'm all for you guys, but uh, it's weird to fly a flag on what you're fucking, right? Yeah, no, I I see your point. Yeah, I never thought about it like that, but yeah, I see. It. And, and then you know the argument that I had with myself on it was was well, well, they had to fight for this. You know, at, at some point, this was if you if you were gay, that was something you had to fight for. So you're flying that flag, but at the same time. Do you just go about your business anyway? You know, like we're 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 cool with you here in Long Beach. It's fine. Do, do you just go about your business, or does everything have to be about what you're fucking? Right? Like, uh, like if I if we switch it to me, if I go all day long, I'm going. I like I like chicks with big asses. Do you know what I mean? All day. That's I fly a flag. I got that you shit got on my. Signs. I got signs. I got it on my car. I got it on my shirt, man. And then you're like, Ian, what's with all the big ass logos? Hey, hey, we get I, it, bro. Yeah, what's with all the big ass logos? And I go, I go, I go. Excuse me, are you you discriminating against me? How how dare you? How dare you? I love big asses, you son of a bitch. <laughs> Just so, a question. So far, we yeah. got fuck your signs. Okay. We mm-hmm. already know to pick up dog shit. Yeah. And who needs a flag? to show who you're fucking right now i think i'm with just about all of those yeah my gay brothers and sisters out there do me a favor and leave a comment well on on why what i well what was his fucking name he passed ralphie may yeah uh-huh right right just get a moment honestly i like rainbows too yeah <laughs> can't use it now yeah and, and not to mention he the, said why do you get all the colors the best pr right like they just took the rainbow. <laughs> yeah, no. it, it's they my, gang- it's ours now. They gangstered it. For now, sure. now ready? You ready for another one? They go. They also went. This is Pride Month. They took pride 
they took the word pride. When when I say it was Pride Month, you knew exactly what I was talking about. For sure. Yeah, you, you didn't think any other pride. You didn't think of Pride Alliance. No, no, you, you thought gay people. They took pride. That is excellent marketing. Like, who's their PR firm, man? Uh, I want gang- in. Super gangster. Gangster. Way to do it. Took it. I applaud them. Like pride. I want I want pride. When you when I when you hear pride, I want you to think of Ian. How do we do that? How do I, how do we do that? Bang the same sex. Bang the same sex. Mm, or, that's yeah. hard for me. Or you could get uh what a double sex change? You can change and change back. Fuck it. I don't Can it's, I do isn't that? Isn't that a thing? Hey, can you do that? If you've changed, can you change back? I don't see why not. No, I mean I mean like physically, like a if if you took the hormones, well, look. If you lop it off, it, you, you ain't getting it back. Lop it off, it's gone. Wait, well, hold on. But they put it on what's his name? Women. No, nah, because or they put it back on on a. Uh, uh, he has three names, and they, a, they threw it out the window. Oh my god! What 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 the hell was his name? It was um it was Bobbitt, so Bobbitt. Bobbitt thank you. Bobbit. Yeah, John Bobbitt. Is that right? John Wayne Bobbitt, maybe? Yeah, it was John Wayne Three names. Bobbitt. John That's Wayne right. Bobbitt. Oh my God. And he tried to do porn. Yep. yep. And they, then he, he. They got it back on a while after. And it works. Co- it can't know. work correctly, though. I don't know. How does it work? Correctly? Oh my God. Imagine the. Yeah, it's all half hard, the other half slim. <laughs> Imagine the. Where, hey, which part? No, no. That's the real question. Okay, go ahead. If they sew your dick back on, yeah. and half of it's going to be limp, and half of it's going to be hard. Which half are you taking? Front half or back half hard? Uh, you got to take uh, the front half is the tip, right? Yeah, well, of course. Yeah, I'm going tip. All right. Yeah, because you can get away with the base being. So- Hold on. <laughs> can- Hold on. See, <laughs> I just I just pictured it you in my have, head. You Hold can't on. push nothing in. Then. <laughs> I just pictured it in my head. <laughs> it's it, it would. Be, it sounded like an easy question. It did. It would almost be like Look, when you're I'm trying. Going ba- to- I'm going back half. Because it's like you know, like when I was building my studio, I had to I had to send the the cables through the wall, right? <laughs> and you had to tape it to a, a, a something hard to get it through. But the problem was, is once it, the hard part got through, I couldn't get the soft part through. <laughs> See, <laughs> but now imagine if you stuff in the soft part, yeah, you got something hard behind it to just pound it in there. Right. So are you I'm, saying I'm going back half? You're going back half for sure. Hmm interesting hold on so if you go <laughs> just that you have to mash the front part in exactly got it you can't mash the back half in if only the front is hard. right here's what i would do you ready popsicle, i would popsicle stick no what i would do is it was insert in the soft part a vibrating mechanism oh, here. so when you stuff it in there because it's floppy it's floppy and <laughs> <laughs> and she just loses her mind. She never had anything like that in her life. You know, it's, it'd be worth worth it, <laughs> or for her, I guess, not for me. So you're saying Terrible. you're going front half? <sighs> no, I think you're right on the back half. I think you gotta go. Back you have half. to. You got front yeah. half. That's that's a problem. <laughs> that's a problem. <laughs> that's a problem because that that hard part goes, and then you still got to keep that though. By the way, that's an anchor. That's an that's a, you have to have the anchor. What? If your front half is hard, brother, you got you got to you you have gotta the boat, base. You got a boat anchor, you, right? Because you can throw it in there, <laughs> but but also not to mention if you have to, it has to physically work because everything for that mechanism to work, the mind, the body, everything has to be correct. And in order for that to happen, and after you've already had all the surgery, that's got to be you know because blood flow after a surgery is difficult, right? That's all blood flow. That's all that is, is blood flow. What a trip. Man, I would love to interview him. Skipping the first half, going straight to the back. Yeah, you're right. No, you're right. That's interesting. I'm going to look that up. I bet you, after this podcast, I'm Googling. Yeah, but how funny does front half hard look in your head? Oh, my God, it's hilarious. (laughs) No, I'm not even thinking about I'm thinking about her trying to figure it out. Like, okay, like she's being she's being a coach, you know, like it's 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 cool. I know you're the famous Bobbit. We get it. Like, you know, give it a go. And she'd have to be fairly open for this to work. There's no, you know, there's no tight individuals with this. There's no way. 
right? It'd have to be ready to go. It'd have to be ready to go. <laughs> Picture that now. Now you got to fling it in. So Bobbitt's got to go last on a gangbang. Bobbitt is way last. Like the tail end of like a fucking 40 man banger. Bobbitt is after the last cream pie. Yep, absolutely. For sure. Sorry about that visual. I didn't think we were going to get here this early. Hold on. You brought it here. I didn't bring it here. You brought it here. Yeah. <laughs> you <laughs> you brought it here. I didn't bring it. What are we at here? We're at uh we're at uh 15 minutes. Yeah, 15 minutes we got into it. Yeah. I brought it here strictly on medical conditions. We were talking about can you get it sewed back on. Right. But yeah. you said I know what I said, damn it, Ian. I'm trying to buy pie. Yeah, and that I, doesn't work for my argument, thank you. Although I said cream pie. Sorry about that. So that's that's the grosser part of it. Eh, I mean it unless you're hungry. Oh, what the fuck? Do you do you know what a cream pie is? I was trying to get you taking a drink. Do you know what a cream pie is though? Yes, I do. Dude. Okay. I'm not gonna explain yeah, it. I'm good. Yeah, I'm good on those, by the way. I'm all set. That is dudes are weird, man. Dude's like weird shit. Like if you you can type anything in, type it in, it comes up. How did that happen? We're strange creature. Internet. Well, I know, but but I mean these people always existed. Facts. So they always existed, but they just kept it to themselves. We just gave them a forum. We gave them a forum, right? We because before. Hey, back, look, there's other fucking weirdos like you. Oh what? Yeah, uh, millions. Go on any video, there's millions, millions of views every day on any porn video. Millions. What does that mean? What does that mean? Like, I want to do the, the math. I wish I could know the area. I think you can Google that because they have records on who's, who's clicking the views in that area. I'd like to know how many people live in that area and how many views from that area came in on, this, on these videos. Meaning, how many people trying are... Trying to find the weirdos. Right. I mean, you can go find the weird video, whatever weird, whatever fucking weird videos you're finding. And you go, you can find these people and go, this town is way into fucking German Bukkake or whatever, right? Whatever it is. Yeah, anything. It's way into <laughs> fucking cake farting. <laughs> that... You know, that's a real one. That's real. You know, do you know that's real? And I also know someone that does that. Rusty trombone, cake farting. I mean, what are we doing? I know a chick that does cake farting. I, I know that. She makes. I believe. It. She makes some okay cash. What a trip. Yeah. What a trip. She's a nice girl. I mean, she, she is. She's a fucking sweetheart. But she's blasted on cakes, man. <laughs> and then they just zoom in. They're just like, good. Very good. Cut. <laughs> and on your mark, speed, and rolling. <laughs> uh, you know, let's do a retake if we can give it a little more energy, please. Thank you. Yeah, but very good. Yeah, and you know, the the director comes over and is like, "Look, I need to I need to feel where you're coming from on this." Oh wow! <laughs> I need to, you know, like the director's taking it serious, like he's directing Saving Private Ryan or I, something. I need your emotion. Yeah, I need to see your emotion on this. And she goes, "Okay, I'll do it." And action. <laughs> it's so stupid. It's so, and on. I want to be on a set of one of those. I gotta I, without laughing. Like you think is the good, whole crew just laughing? Luck. Is yeah, the whole crew I dying mean, laughing? Damn. Like, not while they're rolling. They gotta be though. Because you're, 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 you're not laughing at farts. You're, 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 you're not human, farts. motherfucker. What are you? What are you an alien? What are you dead inside? Are you dead inside? You're not. This is a this is a chick farting on a cake. You tell me you're not <laughs> laughing. You fucking. You're a, you're dead inside. You're There's dead. nothing behind your yeah. eyes. Yeah, you're dead. You got you got to be dead behind your eyes to not laugh at cake farts, but dudes are are jerking it to that. Whoa! Just think about that. You know what I mean? So so here's what I came up with today. Now we're gonna get off the subject. You ready? I'm ready. I'm, I'm taking you out of it. Please. It's me taking you out of porn. Look at you. Yeah. 
Say, who's the who's the mature one now, bitch? Huh? <laughs> Salute this man. That's right. I'm going to shave after this. <laughs> so, but I came up with a great idea because VR is really is really coming. Right. I mean, and it is. Have you ever have you ever been in a VR? I, I, Nick, you're the of the age. No, you ever I, been in like VR rooms or something? I got one. The kids. Oh, you do? Like, like a serious one? Yeah, like, that Oculus. Like the Oculus? Too. Is it is it serious? Like it it's is. really okay. Yeah. It's dope. Okay, I did I did a little sound for a, uh, a VR video game, and uh, and I tested it right. And it, the the test that I did was just basically it, me in France, uh, at, on this villa, and I just look over, and you just feel it. I got the gloves on. I'm in this room, and it felt real, real. Yeah. Not only did it feel real, the only thing that didn't feel real is my hands went through the rail. So that was the only thing, you know what I mean? Because I you walk up to the rail and your hands go boom. Oh, okay. Right. So so you go. Oh, well, that's interesting. But but the, also the interesting thing was is they go they go now jump and I just jumped. I go ah fuck it and they go dude what the fuck you just he's like nobody just jumps and when they do they flinch. I go I, I know it's a game. Like I I know I know it's not real. Like, I get it. Yeah, I get it. They're like no one has ever. I go what does that mean? It means you're crazy. <laughs> I go, I don't think so. I, go, I know it's a game. You're dead inside, Ian. <laughs> oh, either that or I'm alive in real life. Okay, here, but here was my idea that I came up with. Since VR is really coming, and people are doing these VR rooms where they're just getting together with their friends and having coffee in VR, that's happening. And instead of getting together like, like me and you, they're, in a, they're sitting in a VR thing with their avatar, okay? I'm a, I'm a little against it. I get it. I, I, feel, get it. I feel it's the death of humans. I do feel that, but... Since Tinder and all his dating things are, are huge, now you're doing uh, Tinder VR. You're doing dating VR. So you swipe through, you, you're doing the swipes and all that, and someone goes, boom, okay. You can literally meet up and, and speak to this person through this avatar. And I think it's g because so many people are shy, especially nowadays. More and more people are shy, I think. And I think, I think, so I think there's a lot of money to be made here. Are you swiping right on like the three titty alien and shit? Well, no, no. Are they real pictures? Or are no, they, they got to be. Really? No, they got to be right. realish. However, real this this graphic can be. No, I get that. You know what I mean? It's not like avatars that people. Make. No, no. So it's like if if three if titty I, alien from Total Recall. And no, you you can't do it. But she's a. It's not. It's not a video game. So she's a real person. Right. And no, you're I a real get, person on the other end. I get it. But. I mean, I guess that's a good question to be to be had. Like, how far can you go on this avatar? Because that's how I got into this thing of like catfishing, right? People getting catfished in 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 Tinder, and a friend of mine just told me about that. Or this chick showed up, and she was probably ten years older, probably forty pounds heavier, and but yeah, guys are like, I, mean, I still fucked her. I don't give a shit. Man. <laughs> <laughs> He's on Tinker now. Yeah, but but guys, it, it, I went into a little rabbit hole and like guys were writing reports and shit. I mean, uh, girls were writing reports on guys going. This guy showed he had six a six pack in his profile, and he shows up and he's you know gelatinous. Okay. He's five eight. He's you know what I mean. He tell he hadn't done a sit up in years. So I thought the VR Tinder would be big, man. No, I, I it probably would. Yeah, I, I want in. I want in on that. That's going to be huge. And I, I looked it up. I couldn't find anything remotely close to what I'm thinking. All right, so I'll go home, jump on the Oculus, look up VR Tinder, mm -hmm. and let you know. Or VR dating sites. I'm sure there's got to be already. I thought like, so, too. I couldn't, I couldn't really find it. But it's a VR, but I'm saying where you swipe, and literally when they say, oh, you know, I guess you swipe and they have to, I've never done it, but they have to, like, they have to click confirm or something. I'm accepting your word as fact. Okay. They have to. It's either right or left. You swipe left, right or left to like somebody, and but once they do, then you can literally meet up in this VR world, and you can go to any any place, you, and you sit down and have a conversation. But you can go straight to a bar. You can go straight to a bar in Spain. Bar in Spain, like that'd be fucking sick, man. Go sit on the beach. Yeah, it'd be sweet. And then and then. And it's almost a little non-threatening because you guys can meet up and, and if, if she starts to feel he's a creep, she's like, I'm out, bloop. And she just goes, disappear. And she's out, never to see him again. 
Unless he kidnaps her VR fucking avatar. Well, well, that did happen. Did you hear about that? No, but there's a so there yeah. In these VR worlds, did you hear about that, Nick? There's these VR worlds that uh, yeah, they started having people mingle. Like people are mingling and and, and having first order of business. <laughs> Everybody starts getting raped. They start <laughs> VR raping and VR stabbing immediately. And these are nerds, by the way. You know what I mean? These aren't these aren't guys. These aren't gangsters. These are nerds that are sitting in their fucking little VR room. First sort of business is like rape. Rapey, stabby, rapey, stabby. Yeah. <laughs> You're just like, uh, it, was in the, it was in the first uh, vi- of, of the metaverse that Facebook is trying to do, which scares the shit out of me, that whole metaverse thing. Like, do you, don't you see what's happening? Like, oh, my God. But first order of business. That's crazy. Start, everyone started getting assaulted. Let's start stabbing and raping. Yeah, stabbing was, and raping. raping, stabbing. It was it, everything was it. No one was civil. It was it wasn't like, hey, how you guys doing, man? It's good to see you. Cool. Hey, you want to have a virtual drink? Like I don't know what the fuck. Yeah. But here you go. Hey, what's up? You shaking hands? No. For, for, boom! Everyone's blasted. Like I've been waiting to hit somebody. Fucking prison shank in the back. All of a yeah, sudden. yeah. And these are fat gelatinous nerds that are sitting back there mom i want another bag of chips mama yeah where's the chicken while they're in this vr they're all dressed in a suit in 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 tuscany yeah but my question to you drew though like if you if you if your life fucking sucks man and your whole life you couldn't you couldn't talk to anybody you know your whole life you couldn't you didn't have any girls why not why not be a part of this world? I think that's why you have it. Right. But I'm it, straight. Like I know me and you are sitting here and we're if if we're if we're taking a step back, we're being maybe a little you know, we were able to have friends and have and have girlfriends and and, well, you, and you can right? see why it exists. Right. For sure. Right. Because you go, but if if the whole, my whole life I could never even talk to a pretty girl my whole life. Why not be able to be in this world? And one time I get to fucking be, uh, look like Jason Momoa, you know what I mean? And go in there and just talk to some chick that I would never talk to. But then, is it your voice? Because it still sounds all quivery and dumb. And see, even to your point, or I should say to that point, why? I don't give a fuck what you look like. Go talk to whoever the fuck you want to talk to. Yeah, I know, but it's, it's easier said than done. People are in their heads, man. They're in their heads. I get it. I get it. Like, have you given that advice to people? Like, look, that, you see that ultra pretty girl right there? She's more insecure than you are. Facts. So, so kids, you know, everybody, just take it easy. <laughs> take it easy. Just don't sneak up on them. You know, come, come at them this way. <laughs> yeah, that's the golden rule. You, you see that pretty girl, everyone's going to go tell her how pretty she is. Yeah. That's what I'm not gonna do. Yeah, no, no. You, uh, treat her like a person. I might throw some just, fucking just be, uh, tra- fuck person. Well, She's you, gonna be like, "Why are you being mean? To me? Why haven't you acknowledged me?" Well, you don't give them attention, right? But if but if you if you really now here's here's the question: If you really need that girl, you really like because you can't just if you don't give her attention, you just walk away. She never sees you. There is something you got to do. You got to do something. Yeah, that's why I throw stuff at her. Like a yeah, you throw a football at like a, like a her head. Five-year-old. Hey, bitch. <laughs> no, but I walk by like, and pull her hair. No, I think like and and then you. But here, here you go. You don't buy her a drink, you dummies. Don't go. Can I buy you a drink? That's the dumbest thing you do. It's conversation. You, there's you get into a conversation somehow. However that happens, realistically, you get into a conversation. And don't be. I love your eyes. Oh, you're so pretty a real conversation and it helps to have your boys around you like you know hey, why you only yeah. got fucking nine fingers <laughs> yeah well it it is true i mean it, no it is true i i like I, you get into talking like because there was a girl that she was sitting on her hand weird right and so i, I just started talking i got you always sit on your fucking hand like that boom right it, it, you're in now people have said yeah ian i know that works for you but you know i go it Try the confidence world. Try not being quivery and lame. I know it's e- I know it's easier said than done. Believe me, I'm that quivery lame guy too. I've been there, but I'm just saying, it's some it, you get into a conversation of it. Facts. You know what I mean? No, but no, I'll keep rolling. The question of it all is, 
why wouldn't here's a, here's a great example nick is that if uh on your vr can i go into like the amazon jungle is there something like that see so you got to buy the you got to buy the game if i can like i want to travel yeah yeah okay yeah see that's interesting to me see that i'd be into because i'm not i, I, I don't really want to go to the amazon jungle but i would love to navigate through it i would love to or like i don't even really care about going to africa but i would love to just see it through somebody else's eyes and be able to do all that i think that's the same thing we're making it kind of kind of gross i guess by talking about dating and everything kind of gets fucked up within that that realm but if you get to travel the world and learn and do shit that you never ever do in life i think that i think that's pretty cool Yeah. I mean, most of us, most of us don't have the cash to travel the world. I mean, at some point, you got to come back and go back to work. But there's there's so much education that needs to I mean, there's so many things that look, a lot of people I know don't even make it out of Long Beach, let alone let alone check out uh, the Galapagos Islands. You know what I mean? And and culture changes from from city to city. I mean, you you can think everybody acts one way and then you fucking just go to orange county and it's a whole other world then you go to ventura it's another world so that would be something i'm very interested in is traveling the world through vr that is something i'd be very interested in and you can kind of do a little bit uh, like people do that on like youtube they'll do these they'll do these like uh you know they, they they'll travel and they just kind of put the you know the the whatever the fuck that GoPro. is gopro thank you they put the gopro and they kind of walk through that's pretty cool well you when you put the VR headset on, you can watch that as them. You can skydive as the GoPro. You're the GoPro. Does it does it feel? Can you feel it? I mean, like, does your brain yes. think it's feeling it? At first. Okay. Your knees start to, you're like, fuck the fuck. Really? Yeah. I would love to do that. Underwater man. shit. The shark comes by, you'll move. like See. Because it comes from behind you. And yeah. as you turn, you can see everything. So if you turn late. Dude, I'm getting goosebumps thinking about that. How, how good is the graphics? Great. It, it's a GoPro, so it's real. Oh, I see. Oh, dude. And you hear the bubbles everything. and everything in the fucking... The, everything. The oxygen from the mm -hmm. from the tank. Dude. Yep. I'm in. Yeah. Can I, can I come over and, and, and can we play that? Bring it. Oh, my God. I would love that, man. Because... Anytime. Okay, well, then that kind of goes against our little point that we were making, too. You know, how that it, it's bad. I mean, is it bad? Because you're getting education without actually having to swim with sharks. So it's not bad. I wouldn't let my kids live on it. Right. But that's probably the most workout they get. Right. I mean, you're right. Human interaction is, is, is paramount. That is very important to bring it up kids. And I think it's harder for kids to get that type, especially if they don't play sports. You know what I mean? For sure. And a lot of kids are not or, playing sports. So. Or anything organized. Fuck. Right. I was just telling him on the way up here, I was in the fucking rock climbing club. Is that right? I didn't uh, know that. Middle school. Lake I, Elsinore. I didn't know that. That's good workout. Rock climbing. Like, right. What? But yeah, it was fucking fun. Yeah, fuck yeah. Like, but you, how many other kids? You got a bunch of kids in the... Yeah, there's probably about 20. Okay. And you, yeah, you got to interact. Yeah, it's a club at school. Yeah. It was dope. They took you out to Joshua Tree. You went climbing. Dude, that's fucking. sweet, man. Yeah, for sure. That's really cool. Right? That's better than that bitch-ass schools here in Long Beach, man. Yeah, we fuck? didn't. Well, once I got shot at and had to move. Well, okay. So you moved to Long Beach? Hey, yeah. Where'd it no, go? No, no, no. Yeah. Sixth grade was great, right? <laughs> Let's start off sixth grade with getting shot at so you can move out of fucking city. Well, yeah, well, then someone's always got to ruin the party. Right. But we're here. We made it. Yeah, but I, I think... There's pros and cons to everything, but that VR th stuff is so fascinating to me, and it's coming. It's coming big time. Fast. Yeah, real fast. It's faster than you think, man, and, be, and a lot of people are already living in that world where they're not going to the bars or going to a restaurant. They're meeting up uh, in this virtual world with their friends, and I think, that, I think it's a little dangerous, but that's what's, that's what's happening. I mean, if you got like so for me arches in new zealand right 
if I could put the headset on mm -hmm. and he could put a headset on and it was actually us somewhere. Yeah. That's cool for a fucking half hour, 45 minutes, go hang out online. With Hell yeah. And actually, it you can see the person. So right. Almost like you're there. That's cool. Yeah. Uh, all the time and really thinking that's a person that's here with you that you're like me and you communicating like yeah uh, it's it it, it won't feel the same yeah it's it, a big disconnect there right it won't feel the same right like it, it there's no way they can make the human contact well humans have to have contact that is a fact people have to touch each other and when that doesn't happen depression anxiety all that shit starts to set in and that's what's happening what, nowadays is it called, what do they say we have like a village mentality or a town mentality like humans like in the, general like we tend to flock towards each other yeah like a tribal yeah yeah i mean we're all very tribal it's just when people and and i i hate you know how people will put the uh put that as like a bad thing we're all tribal i go i hear that a lot and i i go why is that bad well it, it, everyone's got family right you got it, it, so those are that gets my conspiracy brain going on. Uh -oh. you know, break well, my conspiracy brain, man. You know, trying to break up families. I don't like it. So uh -huh. they're they're doing everything they can do by making certain words bad and things like that that bring family together and and split family apart politically, whatever the fuck. You know, they, those are my theories, man. I'm seeing a lot of things where they're they're whoever they is is breaking up families. And I, and I wonder what the... Uh, and I also think this VR kind of has a, a, a lot to do with that, too. I think these people got some weak-ass families, money. Uh, yeah. The families are, 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 are bitch families. Like, where, where they won't speak to each other if one person leans one way politically or one person... You know what I mean? Like, yeah, that's, that's crazy. I could have a totally different point of view and family's family. Nobody has the same point of view. It just... Uh, it, it shouldn't it, happen. Yeah, but it doesn't. It, it, no one does. It, I don't care who you are. Me and you, I'm sure we see things differently on things. And it's okay. Well, it, even you know, if but, you agree on something, I don't know if you're going to see it the exact same way to you. Right, because it's all it's all experience. Perception. Yeah, it's all perception, perception and, and experience. experience. Correct. And when people are making these these ideals on where they go, a lot of them don't even have experience. They're just finding a side. They just go, ah, that's my They're side. They're going on perception. They're going on perception. <laughs> that's my side. That, you, that looks like it's going to win. Right, exactly. They're, they're, they're like, uh, what is that when you go for the team that always wins? Yeah. Whatever that is. It, or even, uh, oh, they're getting attention. I want attention. So exactly. I'm going to jump on whatever issue this is. Oh, that's big. The, yeah. That's big. The, the social credit score and all that stuff, man, yeah. that is big right now. Where people are, the likes and the, and the like, dislikes. And show the, me a decent human, bro, and you we're know, good. You know, it's, it, it, it's weird. The social credit score is, is happening, too. Sorry, man, I'm going to bring you down. My, my conspiracy brain's been going crazy lately. It's been going crazy. I'm still trying to get over the fact that you just used social credit score in a sentence, and I understood it. Yeah, we'll see. That's the that's a good point. That's a you problem. just made a great point just now. The fact that I know that word, for one, and I said it, and you immediately know what I'm talking about. What does that mean? You just made a good point, and it's a little scary. I do it once in a while, money. <laughs> <laughs> no, but I, what I'm saying is it's a little scary, the fact that we all know what that means. Yeah, it's ridiculous. Yeah. And maybe because I, I, you know where I think I got it though? Here's where I got it from was watching that Black Mirror show. You ever watch that? Nah. On Netflix? It's pretty fucking good. You ever see, you seen that, Nick? Every episode's different. Every episode's different. Yeah, it's, it's, a, it's a British show, but it's big. And it's, it's kind of like what we're talking about right now, where people are getting lost in this VR, this credit score. And like, one, I think one of the first episodes is, is a uh, is a credit score, which means you can't you can't get like a, a an Uber ride if you don't have at least like five stars. So you're left out there in the cold. So and when you walk around, there's a fucking score on you, like a video game and shit. And people won't talk to you if, and every time you get raided. So you go to the bank. You're like, hey, how you doing? Right. So everybody was super nice, right? Hey, good, good, good. And then the moment you leave, you rate her. She rates you, and you leave, and you can oh, see I've the. Seen you seen that one? And then she walks away and she goes, but I was so nice to you, right? Why did you, why did you do that? And she turns around and walks away. But what that does, you go, well, who gives a fuck? Well, you can't go about life once your credit score starts to get lower. You know what I mean? Meaning like if you want to go back into that bank, once you hit a two, you can't go back into your bank. You can't get picked up from an Uber. You can't uh, go fucking in and out, whatever. 
and then the, and people see your credit score everywhere so it's just it's just on your phone they can look at everybody and go ooh she sucks she only has two stars yeah individual not even online it's a, it's individual just walking around wow and that's seems close to what's going down you know it seems like it, it it's an exaggerated version it's an exaggerated sure. version but I've come th across it many times. I don't have a lot of. Uh, it's still a version. <laughs> yeah, yeah, but but like for like say sponsors or uh, getting uh, my shows booked or getting things right. People go, oh, shit, you only have three thousand followers. I, 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 you know, rather than whatever I sound like or whatever my music is, I only have this many followers. It's kind of the same. Yeah. It's kind of the same thing a little bit. And I definitely noticed that with, with sponsors. They've told me, you don't have enough followers for us to give a shit. <laughs> and they, they said it in a nicer way. But I, I get that all over the place. Yeah, that, that, that's a big deal. Now. Yeah, it's a trip. And then you almost go, who gives a fuck about my stupid likes? I don't care about likes. I got more people in this room that I get likes. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. So you go, I got more people that I'm having drinks with right now than have likes on my stupid picture about my puppy. Like, what do you give a fuck? I play music. Like, what do you care about how many likes I have with my dog? You know? So, but what it starts to do, though, I truly don't give a fuck about any of that. But what it starts to do, I start going, well, fuck. I, for me to, I got to get, for me to get paid on this show or the sponsors or whatever, I need to have more likes. It starts to do it on top of my head here we go and now i'm i've fallen into this thing that i bitch at my girl about you know what i mean like baby life is better pick your head up from your fucking phone life is better and i've said that to her most of our relationship things are starting to switch a little bit i'm just going <laughs> fucking got no fucking likes on this yeah now i got now i ain't gonna get no sponsors but i but at the end of the day once i go eh, i don't care i, I truly don't i got too many other shit i gotta worry about you turn into your own marketing. Yeah, I mean it's that's what it is. It's social media is marketing now. Market yourself. Yeah, well, I'm I'm terrible at it. Yeah, I've never here. been good at it. That is, it, uh, I think I was pretty good when the whole flyer when we sit outside shows and flyer. Right. I can do that yeah, for sure. Yeah, that was fun. Hey, yeah, face to face shit, not a problem. Yeah, remember remember the remember the shows where you had the the phone number on the flyer. Yeah, but, when you had to make the flyer. You had to literally, we were sitting in my room, <laughs> cutting out the I, little. I got a white piece of paper. Yeah. Which image are we putting on it? Okay, let's put yeah. this one here. Yeah. Cut the, yeah. Yeah, but there was something to that, though, right? And then you had to take those, the, the taped on images, and then photo, uh, photocopy it. For sure. And then get cut that it. done. Yeah. And it cut and paste. It almost looked like ransom notes. That's and what was so cool about, like, punk flyers and stuff, right? The one with everybody, it was just one big mosh pit. Yeah, I still have that flyer. I got one, too. I got it, too. Yeah. In the move, every move, it gets a little ripped. So I yeah, got it. Mine's pretty beat up, but it, yeah. it's still holding up. Yeah, I got it. I still got that shit. That's our, fir that's our first yeah. real flyer, right? Yep. Yeah. And, and back in. Great back, fucking flyer, by the way. Oh, it's too. fantastic, dude. Great. Flyer. Where where did that? Did you draw that? You drew that, right? God damn it. It's good. It's so simple, but it's good. You, simple. You know exactly what that is. It was dope. Yeah, it's fucking sweet. I'm going to recreate that flyer. Yeah, it is dope. We'll it should be used again. Let's, let's recreate it at some point. Maybe we'll do whatever, some special type of show. We'll recreate that. But what I loved, what you can do is you would put our, our pager number, right? <laughs> our pager number would be at the bottom if you want the address yep. to come to the show. And that's how you knew how many people were coming in because your pager would be going off. Beep, beep, beep. There's one. There's two, right? Yep. I I, I kind of miss that now, man. Don't you? I, I do. I do because I if I look back of how I I started sucking at promotion was was pretty much when the, all flyers disappeared. The internet. Pretty much. But there were still flyers, but then the flyers still now kind of disappeared. Well, in, in a era where the, let's just be honest, there was really no internet. And no had, zero internet, right? You had to network with people. Yeah, that was your likes when when the show started, right? You right. Would pass out fucking eight hundred million flyers, right? And you'd get a hundred people that showed up. Mm -hmm. Did that fucking hundred people felt like a hundred thousand people? Right. Right. I mean, and, and usually they'd bring they'd bring people for sure. Yeah. 
But the, that's the same as your you put your picture the show up on something and one like two likes they're they're getting them on their phone instead of people showing up like right and but that's determining how they feel about themselves right what i've noticed is is a lot of times my draw is better than what it looks like online like it looks like no one's coming all of a sudden the draw is way better i go how how did only you know you do those events and i go how, only five people are going i got five people in my car right now like <laughs> what do we this is weird which means which means uh, i think just you know like our friends and people we know like i don't click it i'm not doing it like i go yeah i'll be at the show i'm not going on your thing yeah, yeah. so it's 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 but that is a, a social credit score and i think a but lot if you of need it yeah. I'll, I'll go on there and click it if i'm not going <laughs> not going bitch no, no I'll, I'll click going just so you get the props and oh i see if i'm not gonna show up yeah i'll click going oh, okay we do that anyways fuck yeah. it yeah but okay. but if i'm going then what the fuck am i i'll see you there buddy i i hate all of it there, there's something a little bit about that that takes a little out of me that i don't like i don't know what it is and i i wish i was better at it but it's just i, I just hate it i hate all of it i hate uh I I I don't, I, don't, I don't hate all of social media, but I definitely I hate what what happens. You know what I mean? I I, I don't. It just you, you get the, you, for one, you're you're exposed to some bullshit. You know whatever it is, it doesn't matter. Whatever the bullshit is, you'll be exposed to something you don't agree with, and now I just had to see it. Or even shit like where they're like a hey, uh, fucking dog rescue. Oh yeah, I'm with. You. I, I want to save pit bulls, and then they show a fucking mangled pit bull. This is what's happening. I go now. That's in my head. Yeah, no, yeah, I can't. Now, uh, now, and I'm I'm picturing it now, and it kills me. It ruins my day. So that's my point. Is like even if I'm with you, but but you, why is that your fucking cover? <laughs> you know what I mean? Like that's like, what we're leading with here. Yeah, we're leading with this crazy shit. You fucking nutcases, man. You nutcases, where it's like, look, I want. I want animals to all be fucking help, but do you got to do all show the, all these fucking elephants getting mangled and shit? Like, come on, man. Like, why are you, you, you overloading me with this, with this bullshit? But I think you got to be real mentally strong to weed all that out, which I'm fairly good at. Yeah, I, I would agree. I'm fairly good at weed and all, getting through all that. And I'm even gotten better at, even if there's somebody I know and they're posting some bullshit. Calling them? No. No, not just, calling. no, just go, just going about my day and go, I don't hey. hate him. I'm not fucking, I'm not even mad at him. I go, I go, I know what this is. This is, this is the world we live in. This is social media. Cause I would have to say a year ago, two years ago, I'd be like, fuck this motherfucker. And I, <laughs> and to this day, I've definitely, uh, we'll say ghosted a lot of people because of some bullshit out post, <laughs> but they weren't really, really, really my friends anyways, but they're more acquaintances and shit. But, uh, but but we don't all have to agree on some shit. But I know if it's if it's real bullshit, and you're just like, ugh, yuck. You you know what I mean, right? Like I'm sure you've seen some shit that we're some, probably thinking of the same people. Yeah, maybe. I mean, there's and the the bad ones were were you know there's some like uh, more acquaintance guys and guys I've worked with on jobs and shit. And they're nice guys, and I go, what the fuck are you posting, you fucking fruitcake? Like what what is this? This is dumb. You know, like the like when that the whole Me Too thing was going on. There's this guy I know, and he go he posted this big thing. There is nothing a man can uh, can do that a woman can't. Then it's just this long fucking rant on how uh, uh, to you should be a male feminist, and we should. And I'm just going, who are you? You fuck? Are you trying to get laid or something? Like what are you doing? Trying to be a white knight? And I went. I was at the bar too and drunk, and I'm yelling at the top of my lungs with this thing and and. <laughs> and jenna's with me and uh we're sitting at the bar and i'm showing it to everyone we're all just making fun of this thing and we're all then we're starting to go through a list jenna's here cool jenna come in on this and so we're we're going through a list of everything a man can do that a woman can't <laughs> and we're just going through this long list and we're just dying laughing we're dying laughing we, and i'm just going simple things uh open pickle jars uh <laughs> it just oh uh, thank you baby oh that's okay thank you sweet thing Hey, I'm talking about that post. The uh, there's nothing a, a, a woman oh, can do that. I'm <laughs> yeah, man. <laughs> I'm joining in on this in a second. <laughs> but anyways, it, we it was it was hours of entertainment. But I know this guy, and I'm going. But after that, I I wanted to comment on it, and I wanted to put our list of all the shit that men can do. You know, but I left I left alone. I never talked to him again. 
and I'm sure he doesn't know why, but I can't, I can't deal. It's probably for the better. Yeah, I can't deal. Like I, I, I think it's for the better. I can't have that person in my life. You know what I mean? Like the zombie apocalypse, that bitch ass ain't going to be there to help out. <laughs> You're tripping him. I'm tripping him. Right. He's food, bitch. That He's food. Go ahead. Like, I want you to rack your brain all the th- Nick, rack your brain all the things men can do that women can't. There's a lot. There's a lot. And you know, I don't even want to go down that. And you know how I know there's a lot? Because there's a lot of men that can do things that I can't do. That's how I know there's a lot. So it's not just men or women, you fucking fruitcake just trying to get pussy. I know what you're doing. It doesn't work. Women don't like bitches like you. All right. Let's say he's serious. Okay. 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 Just just for like he really feels like, that. Like, like he meant he meant it. He meant it. Okay. What's an unpopular opinion you have? An unpopular opinion I have? Yeah. One that one of your opinions that is just you're like, yeah, this is unpopular and I know. Uh, of that men can do that women can't just in general that so drive fucking uh uh pick a channel uh think straight have logic what (laughs) 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 i I went in heavy what (laughs) that shit really hurt him to his soul because he can't get off of it he's like (laughs) fuck this guy (laughs) well because i know what it is no in just in general an unpopular opinion oh uh, like right now uh, what would be an unpopular opinion that uh, like like men are better at sports like just shit any, like that or anything just any of your opinions I guess that's unpopular. unpopular like men are just better at sports bring, think bring in not, money that's uh, not an work. unpopular I think that's just fact but working harder I don't know like it doesn't even have to do with men or women oh just okay curious. he has to me oh wait men, I, I get men, what you're saying men that um or excuse me, women can do the same thing, man. Right. Get, get out of here. That's an unpopular opinion in my book. That's an unpopular, but that's popular to him Spe- and his a specific group, but not fruity group to the general mass. Yeah, he wants like, to be an actor. Like, you know yeah, what I mean? Yeah, it's perfect. I get it. Yeah, yeah, he's trying to be an actor. So what's an? Oh, I see. So so the game is what? What's an unpopular uh, opinion that I have that most people won't agree with? Yeah, I'm just curious if you think you have any. Um. In this room, I don't know. Um, well, j- just in general. Oh, an unpopular opinion. I mean, I, I, fuck, I don't know. I mean, uh, I'm, I'm trying. I'm really racking my brain. That's a hard one. I mean, I, I, I think like, like, like the gun stuff. You know, I don't know. Maybe that one's unpopular sometimes. I got into a little bit of that conversation recently. You know, but usually I win those conversations. I can usually turn somebody. But I, I guess the, like the gun thing is split between people a lot, and I mean, you know, I'm all for guns big time, you know. But uh, I don't know. You, you tell me, like race, like race is a big one. But, but I don't really, uh, I don't think. See, in, well, I don't really think as far as race. I think as far as individual bitches, you know. So, but I mean, I don't know. I, I don't know what, what answer are you looking yeah. for. How about In and Out Burgers really ain't good? You son of a bitch. How dare you? See, I disagree. That's unpopular. In California especially. Oh, oh okay. So I was I was thinking of something more I, I I know. Right. But no, I think uh uh fuck, I don't know, man. Like there's a, there's a lot of things, you know, just maybe the the shit I yell at the commercials sometimes, <laughs> you know, like I'll fucking Yell. You've got to have a million of them. I got a, I got a million of them, but you got me on the spot. You know, it's like, you know, like I see the commercial and the the guy stealing the pe- the guy breaking in has blonde hair and looks like a surfer. That's the motherfucker breaking into your house. Really, really, guys, that's the guy. You want seventies muffs back? <laughs> like, really, the the white surfer's the one breaking and entering. Okay, you fucking dummies. You know what I mean? Just like uh, I don't know, like unpopular opinions. Oh, uh, I mean, um, that they should I let the girls fight the dudes in UFC at lightweights. I definitely don't believe that, but <laughs> I'd love to see it. I'd love to see them get ragdolled. That's but, my opinion. Yeah, that, I mean that's domestic violence, is what that is. Did you, <laughs> domestic violence? Did you watch that fucking clip I sent you at one thirty this morning? 
Uh, which one? I uh, watched some of the comedy. It, nah, yeah, it was the uh, Sydney Castillo, my the domestic violence one. Oh, I, that was the bottom one. I didn't yeah, see that one. Uh -uh. But yeah, that, watch it later. That oh, okay, I'll watch that. I'll watch that later. Yeah, I mean, uh, I, I, everyone definitely has an unpopular opinion. Uh, but the I, oh, I think like the unpopular like uh, I always have opinions about drugs and shit. Like legalize all drugs and people stop making money up. You know, I, I have opinions on drugs and shit. You know, conspiracy theories are usually unpopular. All right, to that point, I yeah. said, I told, me and my brother had a conversation once. Yeah. And I told him, dude, I fucking make everything legal. Yeah. And he was like, what do you mean make everything legal? Make it all legal. Mm -hmm. Everything. Like, anyone that gets out of line will get put back in line pretty quick if everything's legal. Yeah, there's always a hierarchy. And he's yeah. like, so you want to make fucking raping kids legal? I go, oh, you took it to the extreme. Well, I wasn't thinking that, yeah. No, but... Right, so he as soon as you say make everything legal, he takes it to the extreme. Right, and I'm like, yeah, okay, we we went raw with like definitely don't agree with that, but yep. I guess I would have to let that be legal. So would be shooting him in his fucking face. <laughs> like, right now, like, that's where I went too. Was like, well, it, yeah, if that's legal, then then uh, I get to murder that dude. Facts. So maybe he won't. They won't be doing that no more because he doesn't have to worry about going to jail. Yeah, no, I get to shoot you in your face, you fucking diddle kids. Yeah, I'm that. I'm gonna re rape you. You yeah. can go use drugs. Don't hurt nobody. You don't get killed. Like fucking, it's not right. a big deal. But it's the same thing. All of a sudden, weed is legal, and but people have been murdered over weed for or or the liquor. People have been murdered over liquor, and now incarcerated, it's incarcerated, et cetera. Yeah. So it's like. Once you make it legal, they can't bump up the price. The cartel can't fucking sell everything and murder the whole fucking town because we didn't get over the fucking border. You know what I mean? Well, now you go to your street pharmacist anyway, dude. I go to you my street pharmacist. Yeah, who wants to pay taxes at? Yeah, the but stores? like, like here's a here's an example. Uh, everybody's still gonna get coke for sure, and the fact that it's illegal and it's hard to get. It gets chopped up full of poison and all kinds of shit. People are still going to do it. Now they're just poisoning themselves with the shit that's being cut in it. If it was legalized and taxed, I'm all for taxing it. Fuck it. Go ahead and tax that shit. Maybe fix a couple potholes with that. Too bad they don't. No, they don't. I pay 34%. No, they don't, son. No, they it goes right in pockets. But let's just say it did. Let's say it <laughs> went was, You know who does get, yep. clap it up for him is uh, Colorado. Colorado, yeah. When they first, because uh, they're the first ones with the shrooms, yeah, right? Well, when they first legalized marijuana, they fucking uh, used a lot of the tax money on special education and schools and is that right? Thing. Yeah, nice. Which is dope. Yeah, I, I wouldn't mind paying higher taxes if that's where our money went. Exactly, I wouldn't mind at all, but it doesn't. It, it doesn't. just, it just don't, man. It does, and that's that's the sad thing. But but the, but that's that's a very unpopular opinion I have is legalizing drugs. People just can't imagine. I go, I go, yeah, well, because I always go, uh, yeah, legalize heroin because people are shooting up fucked up heroin. But I go, you know what heroin is? It's the fucking pills you're taking. That's heroin, guys. You know, the Oxycontin, that's, that's heroin. It's Facts. just in pill form. Yeah. So we're and, just giving it a different name. And probably cleaner, like you said. Yeah. Yeah, so if you make it illegal, now it's all fucking poisoned and people are shooting themselves up and killing each other for it and blah 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 and and they have to sketchy ass people are making money off it and then these people got to deal with sketchy people i mean that is a very um, i mean that's that's conversation that goes on for days though because where does it end right where because and what is a drug what isn't a drug sniffing fucking glue is that a drug you know what i mean like kids were doing that for a while <laughs> fucking kids kids were sniffing glue putting their their face in paint and like model paint whatever the fuck man like people will do anything to get high they, yeah they just will like wasn't that a thing like with monkeys right the first order of business they did like they, they figured out how to uh 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 leave like fruit over and it fermented and to it became alcohol. alcohol yeah and then all of a sudden monkeys start getting drunk I wouldn't put it past them. Yeah, the I, only I, thing different. What is it? Thumb opposable thumbs. Yeah, but they got, they got a. Uh, they're the closest thing because they can. They got the hands and everything, but they don't have this. The, the thumb doesn't work the same, right? Yeah, that's why I said the only difference is opposable thumbs. Opposable. Excuse me for this. One. What does opposable mean? Imposable. Is it? It's is it? Is it imposable? Not believe, opposable. No, I believe it's. Imposable. Nick, can you look that up on your phone? Is that possible? Opposable thumbs. What does opposable mean? 
Is it? It's imposable. I believe it's spelled imposable. I've been saying it wrong the whole time, but I've never actually thought what that actually means. I could be saying it wrong, but I believe it bends yeah. in towards your hand and allows you to grip things. Like it's you can impose it on things. That's why it's an imposable thumb. I oh. could be. No such thing as opposable. Oh, there is. Because because.